to a few days living in my life as an 18 year old in Hawaii. It is Monday, September 30th, the last day of September. What happened to the summer? Random other stuff to do like paying my rent. <laughs> I say we just start with what you already saw, me making coffee, so I can get through the rest of my day. Also, I'm obsessed with this new mug. I bought it thrifting the other day. I've been thrifting a little too much, which is good for the planet, but not good for my bank account. The universe knows blessings are everywhere. Cheers to that. Breakfast. I'm feeling an omelet. It's bad that I didn't know how to make an omelet before Matt showed me how to make it while he was here. Oh my gosh, this book is so good. I want a man like the man in this book so bad. But I have to finish it today because I want to start September on a brand new book. I don't know, my OCD just works like that, so. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I finished the book. If you haven't yet, go read it. I love a good romance. See the ending they had a plot twist that made me angry, but it's a happy ever after, so. Yay! Anyways, now I'm gonna head to the gym. I have a body pump class to attend to. It's basically a class where you target every part of your body with weights and you basically kill yourself. Every time I do this class, I ache afterwards. So, let's go do it! All right, squat track, hardly any breaks. We start in mid, then we go wide, and then we go wide. Down, up, squat four times. Nice job. All right, take this off. It's hard for me to even hold my phone up right now to be taking this video. That class is intense. Although the more I do it, the easier it's getting. Okay, today's to-do list looks a little something like this. So far, I have finished my book and I did body pump. I still have to journal, clean my house, and pay rent. And yesterday I was supposed to film videos and I never did that. So... I'm gonna have to do it today now. I bought this journal a few weeks ago because my last one was full. It has this cute little mushroom on it. I got it from Ross. Although the pages are really big, so I have to do a lot more writing per day. But I only take up half a page per day, so it makes it a little bit easier. What should I write about today? Sorry, I really was just sitting there thinking about what to write about. Hey Siri, play lo-fi. or want to force yourself to grow, remember that the only way to move forward is organically. You are nature, and nature cannot help but flow to a genuine and unhurried place. If you really want to speed things up, set goals, walk towards them without attachment, and peacefully align with actions that feed your inner harmony. So that means new calendar! The title of this month is We Fell In Love In October, like the girl in red song. Last month it was Do You Remember The 21st Night Of September? And then the month before that, August, was August slipped away to the moment of time. So every month the title needs to be something music themed. First is today on Tuesday. I actually don't know how many days are in this month. Hey Siri, how many days are in October? Okay. Hey Siri, what day is Halloween? Oh, Halloween. And I've already done yoga, uh, but I'm gonna mark it that it was on my calendar anyways. It makes me feel productive if it was there. Non Legend is actually coming to perform on Oahu, which is kind of crazy because no one comes to perform here that's a big artist like him. I wanna see if I can get tickets and go with some friends. I just need to find some friends to go with. If this vlog is out by October 8th and anyone wants to come with me, let's go see John Legend. Anything else happening this month? I guess my month is pretty empty so far. That's okay, that means I have lots of free time. Speaking of free time, I'm so free that I'm gonna head down to the beach now and go start my new book. I love this new blanket that I bought. Well, technically it's a towel. I got it on sale for $25 and look how big it is. I can just nap on the beach. And it's pink and it's cute. And I get to read my new book called A Summer Affair. And I have no clue what it's about, but I think it's about old people based on the fact that their legs look old. Anyway, I also packed the bagel you saw me make earlier. Your girl can eat, I'm hungry. is 
getting in the fridge again. I feel like I go through eras where I lose my appetite and I don't feel like eating much. And then there's times where I eat like 7 million meals a day. Currently, I'm in the era of eating 7 million meals a day. But I'm just going to make a little matcha. Last time I made this, it did not taste very good because I don't know what to do to make it taste like sweet. Bringing back the iconic $30 glass jar. If you remember this from a few months ago. Oh wait, I'm supposed to warm up this milk. I really need to invest in a pot that's smaller. That way when I'm trying to warm up small dishes, I don't have to use my massive one and wash the whole thing. I feel like I just used half of my milk. I need to go grocery shopping. Oh my gosh. I was about to lose a $30 glass. Okay, let's heat up this milk and I can make my matcha. I'm gonna drink this while I do some work. Okay, work in quotes. It's just like little things I need to do, like cancel some subscriptions and whatever, book some flights for 2025. And then later today, I think I'm gonna go hike Diamond Head because I can do it for free now that I have a Hawaii ID. I'm so happy. I have I've come Ina discounts now because I live here. It smells very burnt. Are you able to burn milk? hope this tastes okay. My spare room has been coming together really nicely. I got this new console that is great for guests to store their stuff in. We have my gaming setup, which this room still needs more. Like, I definitely want to deck out this area with cute little gizmos and gadgets. I made myself an acai bowl. There's a side at the bottom of that, I swear. And then we have this guy, which still smells like burnt milk. I am concerned. Okay, like I said, I'm headed off to go to Diamond Head. I'm gonna get a little hiking in today before they close. I actually need directions. Starting route to Let's go. Having a car has made all the difference. I used to take the bus everywhere and that was just such a pain. And now just being able to have free will and go wherever I want, whenever I want is amazing. Oh, there's a policeman. I should probably stop recording now. Love y'all. Target again for the Amelia time. I feel like every single vlog I go to Target. I'm ashamed of it. And tonight my friend is coming over and we're gonna watch a movie. So I figured I'm gonna get a few snacks for this. I'm excited. <laughs> a grocery haul. First up for tonight, Parmesan garlic potato chips, cake and bake baguette. Apparently I have to heat these up in the oven, so maybe I should, how do I heat up oven? Anyways, then we have carrot red pepper hummus. I've been eating that up. It is so, so good. Plain yogurt, sweet kettle corn, kettle, <laughs> kettle corn, <laughs> kernel corn, macaroni and cheese, tofu, mashed potatoes. I don't know why I bought this. It just kind of sounded good. Unsweetened almond milk. And then last but not least, microwave popcorn for tonight. I just made a big girl purchase. I bought Netflix. I have not had a Netflix account for a few years now and I've prided myself on it. Outer Banks is coming out soon and I'm like, I might as well just give in. And also I need a platform to watch a movie tonight. So Netflix, yay. They're stealing my money. The first time I get to use my oven mitt, I've got a knife. Mmm, baguette, wee wee baguette. Okay, that was actually really nice. I just had a movie night with my friend. We watched Queen Pins and I really liked the movie. So my eyes are currently closing on themselves. I am ready to head to bed. Peace out, homies. Good night. 